Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to today's video. So things may look a little bit different. We are filming with a brand new camera. Last week, I was like, you know what? It's time to step up my game with YouTube, TikTok, everything. So I bit the bullet and I bought a brand new 4K camera. So I'm really, really excited to be filming right now, you guys. This is my first like official YouTube video with my new camera. So I cannot wait to like upload this footage. I'm so excited. But for today's video, we have a massive Ulta haul. So I actually did an order online. I went to store a few times. There's the Ulta spring sale happening right now and there's so many good products on sale. Um, and I didn't think my order was coming today because it's Sunday, but it showed up and I was like, oh, all right, so let's film this haul. So there is a lot of goodies in here and I'm so excited to share with you guys. If you're interested, go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and let's jump into this Ulta haul. First things first, I picked up this Kristen S Nano Black 1 and 1 fourth inch curling iron. So, I don't know you guys, I haven't used a curling wand, curling iron in like three years. I have really only been using my Dyson or my, now my Shark. And this, I don't know, I really wanted to get into like those clamping ones. It was on sale, I was, it's funny because I was actually going to buy it last week and it was $65 and I was like, hmm, I don't know. And then I didn't even realize the sale was going on and I checked my cart and it was $45 and I was like, now we are buying it. So this, ooh, hold on, this is what it looks like. So I'm really excited to use it. The reviews were like subpar, like some people said they loved it, some people said it sucked. So I'm really interested to see what the tea is on and I will keep you guys updated on that. Let's jump into this bag. So I actually talked about this on my TikTok Ulta haul last week, but I really wanted to talk to you guys really quick on camera. This is from Pacifica. So this is the Neon Moon Body Lotion. You guys, I am having a love affair with Pacifica. <laughs> like, I don't know what it is. Their products are just bomb. And this smells amazing. And this was only $10. This wasn't on sale when I got it um but it's only it was only ten dollars and the scent you guys is amazing and it lasts all freaking day like i'll put it on in the morning and i'll be like six hours into my shifts and i'll get like a whiff of it and i'll smell my arm and i'm like whoa like it still smells like it so don't underestimate these specifica body lotions if you need a good scented body lotion check them out because this 10 out of 10. I have a lot from Pacifica, so I guess maybe I'll save that for last. So I'll get into everything else right now. So this was really impulsy of me. This is from Nads. This is the Strawberry and Cream Waxing Dots. So I was in Ulta yesterday with my really good friend, Christine, and she picked this up and she actually spilt one everywhere. And I was like, hmm, I don't know. Like I got a wax last month. I got my legs waxed and I got my hoo-ha waxed. Um, and I loved it. And I've gotten them waxed before, but I haven't done it in like five years. So I was like, you know what, instead of spending a ton of money, I'm going to teach myself how to add home wax. So I will keep you guys updated on this because this could either be an epic success or an epic failure. We don't know yet, but I will definitely keep you guys updated because this, I'm really, really excited about that. Up next is from Batiste. It's from Batiste. It's from Batiste. This is a dry shampoo overnight deep cleanse. So this was another impulse buy when I was in Ulta yesterday. I saw this and was like, Overnight deep cleanse. That sounds very, very intriguing. And I actually tried it last night and I loved the results. My hair, like I really use, I really, I only really use the brunette version from them and I love it, but it leaves a residue. When I woke up this morning and I like ran my fingers through my hair, there was no residue. And I still right now feel no residue and I feel no oil. So this so far, I am into. Next product I bought solely because of an Instagram ad. In that ad it said, reverse one year of hair damage in one use. That is a bold freaking claim. This is from Redken. This is the Acidic Bonding Concentrate. So when I saw that I was like, my hair's pretty damaged. It's been damaged for like five years. Um, Let's see if this will actually work. I don't know how faith, that's a bold claim. One year in one use. I smell something suspicious and I will be the one to let you guys know if this is a gimmick or if it actually works because my hair, it may not look it, but it definitely is like on the more damaged side because I obviously bleach it pretty much like every two months because I'm a lunatic. But yeah, so I will keep you guys updated on that. And then I restocked on some pimple patches. These are from Hero. These are the Mighty Patches. Love these. I put them on all my pimples. Do they always work? No, but do they work most of the time? Yes. So I had to restock on those. With my skin lately, you guys, I don't know if you can tell, but it is, we are not on good terms. I don't know if I'm trying too many products. I probably am, honestly. Um, But my skin is like, bitch, like whatever you're doing, stop. Because it is like, my pimples are like, not like regular like cute pimples. They're like big red like inflamed pimples. Like never in my life have I had like problems like this. So I think it's maybe my like 
me trying too many products. Okay, up next is another restock. This is from Tree Hut. This is the Tropic Glow Moisturizing Shave Oil. This is amazing. It's the only like way that I shave, even though I'm trying to switch to waxing. I did need to restock on this just because in case this, is, this doesn't work, at least I have this. Um, and Tree Hut is 25% off right now, so definitely check them out. And so is Batiste. This was, I think, $12, and I got it for eight, so. Definitely get on it. Up next is brand new. This is from Jacqueline Hill. This is the bl uh, Plush Blush Blurring Cheek Tint. I picked mine up in this shade. Why won't you focus? New camera props, guys. Is you gonna focus or are you gonna play me? It doesn't wanna focus, but anyways, I got mine in the shade uh, Coral Plush. So the packaging is stunning. Let's see if the camera focuses. No? All right, cool. So I'm going to show you guys what the color looks like. So it is definitely a gorgeous color. Um, I did do a video on it. You guys will see that shortly. So stay tuned for that because I have some thoughts on this guy right here, okay? And we have this. This is brand new from Too Faced. This is the Too Faced Born This Way Healthy Glow Moisturizing Skin Tint with SPF 30 in it. And I have been meaning to pick this up for a while. And I finally saw it in person in Ulta yesterday. And I was like, all right, it's time to stop playing games and pick this up. If you guys don't know, my Holy Grail concealer is the Too Faced Born This Way, so it would only make sense that I would probably like this. So it is what I'm wearing on my face right now. You guys, let me know what you think, and then you will hear my thoughts later on this week. I will definitely be uploading a short and a TikTok on it, so stay tuned for that. So everything else is from Pacifica. There's one item that I didn't get yet, and I'm going to show you guys which one it is really quickly. This product, for some reason, is shipping separately. I don't know why. This is from Pacifica. It's the Flower Moon Spray Perfume. And I didn't want to wait to film this video just for one product. So I was like, let me just show you guys what it was. Okay. So up first, I picked up this Moon Moon Mood Hair and Body Mist. So in here, you get three body sprays. By the way, Pacifica right now is 25% off. So definitely check them out. You get Dream Moon. Uh, Wait, no. I don't have that one. Okay. You get Dream Moon, Flower Moon, and Silver Moon. Do I know how these smell? No. Did I go out on a whim? Yes. So I will definitely keep you guys updated there. And then, oh my god, wait, we have one more product that's not Pacifica. Wow. This is from Good Molecules, and I really don't know why I bought this, but I just picked it up. It's the Super Peptide Serum. So this is supposed to target fine lines and wrinkles and... Anything that's going to stop me from aging, I am into. Let me actually take this out of the packaging. I don't know why I started to and then I stopped. Here's what the packaging looks like. I really have been enjoying Good Molecules lately. Good Molecules and Pacifica are really just like up here right now, you guys. I am highly, highly enjoying them. So everything else in this bag is now from Pacifica. So up first, this is the Wake Up Beautiful, Beautiful Complex Lip Balm. If you guys watched my March favorites, then you heard my little spiel about me trying to be like more clean with the products that I'm using. So on my little app that I've been loving called Yuka, um, this was rated 100 out of 100. So I was like, whoa, this is a really good product. I've never heard anybody talk about it before. So I had to pick it up and I will definitely let you guys know my thoughts. I have three perfumes, you guys. Now you ask. Does she need more? No, but do I ever need any of this stuff that I buy? Again, no. And am I sorry? Absolutely not. Okay, so up first is Silver Moon. Again, all of this was 25% off. So these retail for $22 and I got them for 15. I was like, wait. Okay, so this is what it looks like. I guess they don't come with caps. That's a little like strange. Okay, let's smell her. Let's see. Oh my god. Oh, wow. What are the notes in here? Vanilla, almond, and spice. Ho oh, ho ho. This smells. Whoa. What it smells like, I don't know. But it's reminding me of something from my childhood. Wow. Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep. We. We are into her. Okay. Up next is Dream Moon. I feel like I have smelt her, but I'm also, I'm also not sure. So let's see. And no cap. So these obviously wouldn't work for travel purposes, but I mean day to day, they should be fine. So let's spray on this arm. Oh, she's cute. She's spicy. Is there any spice in here? Uh, nope, but I smell the patchouli and the sandalwood. That's what I'm smelling. Wow. Mm-hmm. Yep, and pink roses. Patchouli, sandalwood, and pink rolls. Pink rose, not rolls. 
Yeah, this is, yep, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You guys, I don't know why nobody talks about Pacifica. I am so confused because I'm over here, like, being such a fangirl. Like, I never knew their products were this bomb. And if you follow me on TikTok, I think I talked about it on TikTok, they sent me a huge, like, package with a bunch of stuff in there. And I have been having an extreme love affair with them. Like, Pacifica, if you're watching this, like, let's, you want to sponsor me? I am game. Then we have Tahiti Gardenia. So this one I have smelled. I smelled the body spray, not the perfume, but you guys, if you're a loyal fan on this channel, you know that KKW fragrances are some of my favorite. And obviously she shut down the website. KKW, by the way, was Kim Kardashian's perfume line. I think she shut it down because of the W, so since she's not married to Kanye anymore, that's what I would assume. But anyways, this perfume is Crystal Gardenia, okay? Smells beautiful. I have like nothing left in here, and then I kind of have like a like a half full one over there. So I was at Ulta, oh, and I smelt the body spray of this. Okay, so I was like, whoa, this smells almost identical. Okay, I'm gonna spray this on my hand. Okay, wait, this is the packaging. I'm getting a little too excited. I don't know if it's gonna focus. Yeah, there you go. It's beautiful packaging. All right, let's get into how it smells. It's almost an exact dupe. This one, uh-oh. This one, it's a little bit more sweet. Yeah, this one, I think it's a little bit more, more like gardenia-like. I definitely still prefer like obviously the, the OG, but I am not mad at this one. This one smells a little bit obviously more intense than the body spray because it's a perfume, but you yeah, know, this one I do, I do like, but I do prefer the, Gard the Crystal Gardenia one. But you guys, do not sleep on Pacifica, especially since you can get them for 25% off right now. Like, you would be crazy not to, like, look into these products. The perfume that I don't have, I just realized, is in this little body spray trio. So we might as well give her a smell, considering we don't have the actual perfume. So let's get into this. So this is the one that I'm waiting on to come in the perfume. What's, what are you doing, you pinky? <laughs> that, I, this is the one I'm waiting on to come. So let's smell her. Where am I gonna smell? I guess I'll spray her on the tan. This one is Jasmine, Peach, and Vanilla. She's, she's weak. She's weak. She's not, uh, she's not bad. She's cute. She's not my fave. My fave, I think, would have to be the first one, which is Silver Moon. Yeah, this one, you guys, whoa, I am really into this one right now. Hey right, guys, so that wraps up this Ulta spring sale haul. I didn't even know that Ulta did a spring sale haul, but I mean, this time last year, I was going through like a really traumatic thing in my life, so I blocked out a lot of things, and sometimes people will be like, oh, this happened, and I'm like, did it? Because I just don't remember, because like, just had like a mental block, if you guys know, you know, but um, yeah, so anyways, that is everything that I picked up. Make sure you check out the spring sale. I'm pretty sure it goes on until the 15th or the 14th, and then the Sephora sale starts on the 14th. TikTok, I did upload my Sephora VIB sale recommendations. I uploaded like six different videos, so if you guys have TikTok, definitely check those out if you're looking for my recommendations. This was a very successful haul, you guys. I am, like I said, vibing heavy with Pacifica right now. Like me and Pacifica, we are like on the same page with things. I'm really into them. So let me know down below if you like them, if you never tried them before. But yeah, so as always, thank you guys so, so much for watching. Let me know how you like this camera quality. Like, is it too much? I'm a little insecure because I don't know, it's 4K and I just, I feel like people are gonna see things and I'm like, oh, I don't know, I just, I'm feeling really insecure about it. So let me know your thoughts. But as always, thank you guys so, so much for watching. Please do not forget to go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up and to subscribe and I will hopefully catch you guys in my next video.